I'd like to ask you a couple of questions. Have you been really thirsty in the last 24 hours? Did you have a hard time getting something to drink? Did you wonder if what you drank to cringe your thirst was going to make you sick, or maybe even kill you? Probably not, but there are places in this world where people no different from you and me have to walk miles just to bring home a bucket of water so dirty that some who drink it will become sick or maybe even die. This water, this is not a little problem. Over one billion people lack access to clean water. Every 15 seconds, a child dies from the water because he or she didn't have enough clean water. They die because they drink untreated water from puddles, pits, and streams polluted by livestock and human waste. This water is often filled with microbes that cause acute diarrhea and other illnesses that lead to death. Now let me ask you another question. Have you ever actually saved a life? Not many people have, but if you will join me in this adventure of a little bit of self-sacrifice for just two weeks, you'll be able to rescue, literally rescue a child from death. Most of the time, clean water is available, but it's not accessible. All that's needed is a well, water tank, or small dam. Now you can help provide one by taking part in the water challenge. Here's how. I want to, want to challenge you to make water your only beverage for two weeks, just for two weeks. During that time, take the money you would have spent on soda, juice, sports drinks, bottled water, and put it aside for these needy people. If you're heading toward the soda machine, head for the water fountain instead. Your family goes out to dinner, and you usually order iced tea. Ask for water. It's free. Collect your savings in a cup wrapped with the water challenge label that we will give you. Continue your sacrifice for two weeks. You'll be amazed at how the savings add up. Encourage your whole team to participate. After two weeks, we will calculate um, the amount of money saved by your sacrifice. We will make out a check for that amount payable to the water project. It will be used to drill a well in Kenya where the need of water is desperate. If you have any questions or feel as though you're only willing to make a donation, please see any of Mrs. Romani's ambassadors of change.